I better stay there for a little while until I until I I know I can work things out and find something. Yeah. Because the caseworkers know that you're sick and that you know, and they would take they would help me out. Now you you know you burst, you really burst my bubble. I was really looking forward to. Not really. No. Well, I can only stay here three months and then my insurance uh, is no more good here. Yeah, that's it. Well, the guy you talked to is the one that was the one's in charge. The guy you spoke with. I didn't say guy. I said you spoke to the lady. That's the one that's in charge. You talk, I got three months and that's it. And then I got to go. I don't know if I'm going to last three months here. I can walk out the door and die and catch a cab over it. And my friend and my roommate, we've already checked things out. I can go and catch a greyhound. It's going to cost me a little bit, but you know, I don't even have to come back to Marin and, and, and then I'll have to figure things out myself because nobody's helping me. Is that what you want me to do? The virus has nothing to do with this. If I have to, I'll, I'll, I will. I will. I will go and, and uh, catch a greyhound and come back to Marin and and, and call my caseworkers and then I'll tell them what's going on. But they don't want to see me outside, and they will definitely. They will find me something. They. You don't know that. You don't know that. When when things when things are, are down like that, they will they will go and they will find me something. They will find me another hotel over there. Not the ones that are not the ones that yes I can. Look at if you don't want to help, you, you don't want to help. Huh? 
nobody's lying to nobody. I need to make a move, and I'm going to do it. And if you don't want to help, you don't have to help. And, and, and I don't want nothing to do with you. I mean, if this is the way you're going to treat me, then, then, that, then you go. I know you're sick and you're old. I don't want you to do anything. If you don't want to do it, you don't have to do it. But I'm going to, I'm going to, I'm going to, are you listening? I said, you don't have to do anything. I, I just, you said you're not going to help. You go, nope, you won't worry about it. I won't take, I won't do it myself. And whatever happens, whatever happens, be happy. <laughs> you don't know what's going on here. You don't know what I eat and what I, what it's about. The food is garbage here. This is the worst. This is the worst one I've been in. I mean... No. Well, look, I'm not going to argue with you. I just let me know that I just tell you thank you for helping me. You know, not doing anything. Well, it seems like you're always getting up and running around and, and doing things. You. You always seem to get up. You always go, oh, I got to go here, I got to go here. You, you. Yeah. All right. Well, anyway, I'm not going to argue with you. I, I, you want to help me, you don't, you don't worry about it. I, I, will take, I, will, I will take care of you. Outside. I mean, it's better, better than being all the way down here in Lancaster and down in by LA. This is, you know, if I would have known this, I would have never came down here. Okay, I had a choice when I was over in the hospital in Marin, and, I, and I, they promised me how what this place was like, and it's nothing like what they said. They lied to me. Yes, they did. Nothing like what they said it was going to be like. No, I wish I would have known this was how it was. I would have never left. Well, because they said I had to leave. It is a mess. And I'm not going to bother you anymore. I'm going to come back to Marin. We'll probably leave here eventually. And, and uh, do whatever. Oh, thank you.
three cloths high. I have four or five of them. Lisa, I was working with Lisa and working with Joey and all those others, you know. No, I don't. No, I don't want you getting involved. Because you're not going anywhere. You're not doing anything. If you did, I would already be over there today. You turned me down. No, 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 no. You don't understand. I don't care what they told you. I'll sleep outside. I'm a survivor. I slept outside for eight years. Okay? Well, <laughs> Well, I was well, I did. I was walking on a different program. Look, I'm not going to argue with you, all right? I, I'm, I want to do what I got to do. Eventually, I would do is just say, all I did was call up and say thank you for not helping me. You know, okay? Uh, no, no, I'm not, I, I got to go. I, I gotta go. I, I'm gonna uh, do what I gotta do. All I did was call up to see if you change your mind and, and just say that you're not, thank you for not helping me. You know, whatever happens to me. No, you haven't helped me. You have not helped me. Before you were sick, you did not let, no, listen to me. Would be when I, before I was sick and I was living outside, I had to do all this on my own. Nobody helped me. Nobody helped me. I got my own food stamps. I got my own GA money going. You nobody helped me. No. No. No, you don't seem to understand. You're, you're making excuses. You're not, you're not, you're not. Look at, look at, look at. I ain't not going to argue with you. All right, I, I'm going to go. And uh, what I do is my business. And I won't, I won't involve you. I won't touch you. I won't. I can do anything I have. I walk out, walk out of here anytime I want. And I, and, and I, I got the money. And, and you know, you still seem to understand. I'm gonna go. I, I, I take it. I take a gray hair. I go up there. I go down to the river and get my medications. Easy. Okay? Well, I gotta take a chance. I will talk to you later. Alright? If anything changes, if anything for the good, call me. If not, don't even worry about it anymore. I gotta go. Bye bye. Bye-bye. She, yeah.